This short video is about drawing a line that matches the route listeners will follow when they do your voice map tour. It's almost always the first step after you create the tour, which I'm doing right now. The exceptions are tours with no route and driving tours with a long and complex route. When the route map tab first opens, the move map tab will be selected. To move around the map, click and hold then drag the cursor. We recommend mapping the route in satellite mode and zooming in as close as you can, so you can draw your route line as accurately as possible. Find the location where your tour starts. Select Draw Route and click on the map. You'll need to make sure the plus node symbol is selected. This adds your first node now, click where you want the listener to go next. As you add additional nodes, you'll see a line being created. If you make a mistake, click the trash can symbol to delete the last node created. You can also delete a node by right-clicking on it. The root line is what the listener will be following, so you want to be as accurate as possible. Stick to one side of the road, go around buildings, and use pedestrian crossings where possible. We'll also use this line to estimate how long each location's audio can be, and the more accurate the line is, the more accurate these estimates are, which ends up saving you a lot of time later in the process. As you add to your route line, you'll see the distance and time increase on the left of the screen. The time shown is how long it would take to complete the route from start to finish, without stopping, at the estimated speed for your tour type. This is a walking tour, so it's based on an average walking speed of 5 km per hour, or about 3 miles per hour. Once you're happy with your route, click Save. You can also come back to this tab, and add to or adjust your route line later. The next step is adding the locations where audio will play. You can do this a few locations at a time, and extend your route as you go, or finish your route line first, and then add all the locations afterwards.